girls and boys ladies and gentlemen you're building this canopy here it's between the extension and the other extension or shed for neighbor as you see though not straight the gap here on the other side so we take this one you go from this wall this is C16 treated pressure treated we bought as you see this 4.8 meters we prefer to just put the straight one not to half just one piece this one this this bolt was snapped so there's a fixing there's a roll block and the bolt goes straight in is that that side this side when we put the legs as we do we got the dirty oil change the oil from your car what we do we soak the legs inside the oil and we stick it to the ground so it stop rotting like uh, when they use in the, 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 the slippers they use in the railway the same method so we put the legs there this one we couldn't even dig it it was so hard so we just left it behind because it's quite solid so there's three legs the other side middle support and the top same thing they're one piece uh, what I want to tell you yes um, as I tell you this side we couldn't we couldn't really this side because we couldn't get the screwdriver underneath we thought we can do that um, uh, do that uh, little screws and fixing on the top with a screwdriver was difficult so this one was so difficult so we have to move this one back again so in line with the rest of them so anyway we pull it a little bit out so the gutter doesn't stop us to do our job that's one of the reason I want to tell you and the middle section we just do it one by one because I have to stay in the middle go inside this one and it's quite hard between these two gap this one and that so I just do one by one I go up there because I've got a lot of a space here so I do one again I go to the other one and I put another one so that's don't do it from beginning otherwise uh, I don't have a long arm you cannot reach so that's uh, the other one I tell you what more this side we put a bracket underneath them it's quite solid there so we use all the decking screws here there are all decking screws on the so, so they don't rot in the future and these ones are all external screws we use uh, what more to tell you yes uh, so we put another support here between that one because we could not fix our legs to the neighbors because as you see they're already cracked this one the other one they're all cracked and we are not allowed to put the legs otherwise it would be stronger if the legs go there but we stick it there and that's just a support i'm gonna move that's it and we're gonna put another support where my gloves is behind between these two I've got a little bit movement but I'm gonna put something there too by putting these two pieces hold your uh, structure push against the other one so at uh, even in this windy or snowy or whatever there is no pressure that much on this ones on the wall because they are as you as you know they are um, um, air crates behind this one and they are not strong to hold the thing so all the structure is one piece that's it uh, one more da, da, da. oh yeah we put another piece here on the back this one to hold this tummy here uh, let's see what problem I had when I was fix this one yeah the panels because the, this side as you see we got plenty gap but the other side the gap get narrower and narrower so make sure you put all your panel from this side and then insert it back there all my panels are there and one by one I pull it out and I fix it here because I couldn't insert it from that side I got the gutter there 
So put all my panels from this big gap here and slide them that side and use them one by one. Uh, that's another one. One more. As you see, we put the foam there, get the vibration and the noise. That's it. I think I cover more or less everything. I don't remember anything else to tell you guys. Uh, uh, that's it. Thanks for watching. Bye.